Hello there. Here we are with the cicadas again. The nice part of the night, isn't it? It's, uh, was this dusk? Is that what this is? And it's going to rain probably in a few hours. And the light is nice. He's asking me if this is dusk. <laughs> what else? I just got done playing tennis with our daughter, so. So you're in a bad mood? No, well, yeah, I am that because she can beat me. And, uh, but I played well in the last game or two, but that's why I'm a little, uh, a little messy. You can't, look, the Wendella people gave us this shirt, it's backwards because we've got the camera reversed so we can read your comments, but it's a nice. It's Happy a nice, Monday, Patrick. Nice Wendella shirt there. Hold up a mirror and it'll look right to you. Yeah, I know. That's what people are doing. Marianne's Holding upset with me because I'm wearing a hat. She doesn't like it when I wear a hat. No. But my, ha my hair is all... I have crazy hair because I was playing tennis. Let's see. Take it off. Look. I have crazy hair. <laughs> I like it. Hi, Tony. Hi, Marianne. Hi, Jeff. Oh, you miss us. Thank you. Hi, Le Linda. Um, Linda, I recognize your name from... Hi, Jim. You share our Facebook Live often. Thank you very much for doing that. You know what? I'm going to do it myself now. I'm going to share this so that from our page, if I can even find it, so um, all our friends can see it, all the personal friends can see it too. You know what? I, I'm actually very proud of this video clip that's posted uh, It's just a little below us, maybe one or two posts underneath here because, well, right underneath I think is a... Uh, we have, we Patrick made some brownies tonight. Yum. Hey, what kind Hi, of brownies? Are they magic brownies? Hi, Marianne. I think we have the eclipse glasses Thanks, on. Thanks, Marianne. With uh -huh. the other planetarium guy uh, underneath here. And then underneath that, because Roger Ebert was inducted into the Writers Hall of Fame in Chicago over the weekend, we posted that Channel 11 Friday night show in Chicago tonight, a half hour interview I did with Roger in 2003, which sadly turned out to be the last long interview he was able to do. And he always. He always uh, talked about that as being uh, one of his favorites. Uh, not that I was any good, but because he got to really talk about the newspaper. Business. Right, you let you just let him talk his, for a long time. His, his real love, I mean, that in the movies. So anyway, check it out if you also, uh, if you have like about twenty two minutes. Uh, it's underneath there, isn't it? Underneath well, it's, there. it's a few it's a few posts. Yeah. Down. it's on our YouTube page. Go to youtubecom slash Serrata Marciano. You'll see it there. Link. And the link is right posted with this. Yeah. yeah. Wait, I'm sharing. Uh, I'm going to say we're on right now. There we go. Now, okay. But you know who's on um, in just a few minutes, don't you? Well, how does he do it? The President of the United States talking about Afghanistan tonight <laughs> at 8 o'clock <laughs> Chicago time, I think. So, let's talk about something else. How about um, I'm, I'm, this is like this is on a delay, so I'm watching you do your thing um, right here. Um, I forgot what I was gonna say, but oh yeah, thank you so much for sharing. And um, we, what did we do this weekend? Oh, we did something so fun. Now I don't even think you can see it anymore because on my at Havana Girl Instagram account, I did an Instagram story about it. We decided yesterday it was noon. And I felt so trapped in our well, beautiful uh, suburban house, but there's something about the trapped. Chicago air and water show that I just love. And I felt trapped because I was nowhere near the air and water show. So at around noon, we decided that it would be a good idea to jump on a train and see it. And boy, was that the best decision ever. That was so much fun. So we get off. Uh, we we didn't get out of the house in time, so we got we got off at the Sedgwick stop, and, we, and as soon as we got on the platform, this heart stopping noise because uh, the the Blue Angels flew right overhead, and so we uh, stayed on the L platform there in Sedgwick and saw most of the air show from there. I know we were on our way to the lake, North Avenue, but right? yeah, but we didn't make it, and but we just stayed up there and saw yeah. it. Hang on a second, um, let me talk to the yeah. cicadas. Hey, hey. Hey, cool it. Could you keep it down? We're trying to do a Facebook Live here. <coughs> they are loud, aren't and they? And it's so um, dark here, too. Isn't it dark? We should turn on the light. We no, don't have... Nice. The lighting is nice. The lighting is nice. I don't do you think You like so. the lighting out there? No, it looks really dark. We need a light or something. Or no, just, it's pleasant. We need it's to come nice. out it's soft, earlier. It's soft lighting. And then the eclipse. 
today? Did you guys see the eclipse? The eclipse. I mean, the eclipse. Okay, so we had in Chicago, we had 89%, I don't know if you would call it 89% totality. Um, I would have freaked out if I saw you on the platform. No, you would have <laughs> come up and said hello. Lighting is fine. So see? Lighting is fine. Okay. Perfect, exactly. Anyway, so, um, so the eclipse, where were you during the eclipse? We were having a, a business lunch. And we went out. Every, it was fun I to left see everybody Bob outside. With, uh, the, the, the guy that we were meeting with, I left them both at the table and I ran out. And I just, you know, there were so many like wisps of clouds right in front of it. But if you looked at it long enough with the glasses, you know, you'd catch it. So, and then it eventually cleared up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yes, if you turn on a light, you're going to get more bugs. That's true, Patrick. Uh, cloudy here in Johnsburg. <coughs> I'm seeing the comments there. Ooh, Laura, bye. I'm watching Dirty Dancing Marathon. I love that. Yeah, I watched, that was so fun. Every once in a while now, they're running all the president's men, I think, because of all the craziness going on in Washington. And that, that movie, every time I see it, I think this is one of my all-time favorite movies, one of the best movies ever made. And I, I pay attention to it so many times. If you haven't seen all the President's Men in, in a while, watch it again. How was it in Illinois? Is the question. The, the comments are going by so fast. Uh, well, the, they had. It depends where Southern you. Southern Illinois wasn't bad. Up uh, around Chicago, it was uh, mostly cloudy, but the the, but we, the sun peaked out a little bit. We had 89 percent totality mm -hmm. here. My son was in Kansas, and then he and his friends drove to Nebraska and they saw it and it was completely clear and he said it was the most beautiful thing he had ever seen. He, it was just awe-inspiring. So um, I wish I had seen that. That would have been nice. Wait, did you see Tom Skilling crying? No. Really? He got emotional? <laughs> oh. Really? Well. I'm going to have to Google that. <laughs> I love anybody, him. If anybody, anybody would, I guess Hi, he George. would. Hi, George. Yeah. Oh my God, we I, we missed that. Where 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 did they send Tom? Did they send him down? He wept down, openly. Did says they Angela. Send, did they send him downstate? They Wait. must have, huh? Unless he was at the Adler. We'll find out. Well, but why would he be crying at the Adler? He would be crying when he saw the, like the whole thing, probably. Really. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Really. I'm I'm I am uh, googling Tom Skilling crying. Oh yeah. Oh my God! Was he watching That's so sweet. live or on a monitor? Or, oh, he was in Carbondale. Okay, so he was he was in the right right spot. Hey, SIU, it's once again the party headquarters because Aww. of today, right? Yeah, we love Tom. He watched the total uh, solar eclipse in Car Car Carbondale, and his emotional reaction was broadcast on TV. He teared up, hugged those around him, and even started singing Here Comes the Sun with fellow <laughs> Eclipse Watchers. How sweet is that? I love him. Let's get him on the show tomorrow. Can we do that? <laughs> he works for WGN TV and radio. Marianne, yeah. well, let me just say... It would have been a good idea. Let me just think? say, if you haven't seen the Johnny Depp movie, Ed Wood, go <laughs> see it because... Uh, Ed Wood. Well, I'm talking about the enthusiastic. Um, what's the word? Not not uh, aptitude, but the enthusiastic. Oh, okay, whatever. I'll think of the word. The enthusiastic. Look, I'm watching uh, him right now. He's right there. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Our daughter is going, um, have fun. You look really cute. She's going to a soccer game, a high school soccer game. Marianne has the enthusiastic... Just say enthusiasm. <laughs> enthusiasm. Enthusiasm. Good ideas. How about that? Optimism, I'd say. <laughs> optimism. To do everything and anything. Yes. Yeah. I am the yes girl. 
Hey, we oh. ate and we ate yesterday after we were in the city, so we went to one of my favorite places. And oh, that you know how so good. you know how you think, boy, I used to go to this place years ago, and then if it's still there, no you mosquitoes. Go. If it's still there, you go, and then you're disappointed because it's not the same. Well, guess what? This place is still as great as it ever was on the corner of uh, Webster and Halstead, right next to Glasgow's Bar. There, the Athenian Room. We used to call it Alexandros the best gyro sandwich anywhere, the best Greek chicken, and we sat outside and had a wonderful dinner. I saw my old friend Anna, who was there behind the counter, um, and what she is, remembered me because I was the only one who got a pickle with my gyro sandwich. What inspiring event would it take for one of you guys to cry on the air? Inspiring event? Inspiring? Well... I think, uh, well, if, uh, for example, um, uh, Uh, I cry when there's sad news and sad stories. I mean, I often cry. I would be moved to tears if somebody found uh, the first WLS Music Radio survey with my picture on it. I'm just kidding. I cry. I'm going to give away tomorrow. You remember the shirt Marianne made fun of on the air? I just thought of this. We'll do it tomorrow maybe or the next time we do Facebook Live. That shirt that Marianne claimed and I guess was too big and we posted you a, we post you posted something on Instagram I and think Facebook, I just saw a bat a Louisville slugger uh, and 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 you know you know the shirt I'm talking about we, she was talking about on the radio on a WLS show on between 10 and noon and uh, I put it in the giveaway pile but yes. maybe I'll, I'll get it and give it away as the prize tomorrow or the next day whenever we do Facebook live again meantime there's a book about the 70s and the whole rock era called beat them Beat Me Till I'm Famous by Billy McCarthy, and it's uh, a no-punches-pulled memoir that sucks you in like the Hollywood dream it describes. It won't let you quit until you're finished, or rather, it's finished with you. A lot of stuff in here about the uh, music business. Anyway, uh, in just a minute, we'll tell you how you can uh, get this book for free by just being aware of something on our susosfork.com page. Yep, that's okay? right. Um, I thought Marianne was going to cry after talking about Jerry Lewis. No. Well. Oh, yeah, well, yeah. she was I used in to, love I, with him. I was in love with him, yeah. actually. I mean, when I was a little girl, I was in love with him. I, I, I was. Hey, we're going to sign off because um, people want to watch The President. Okay, yeah. Let's do that. So, so if you go to susosfork.com, okay, susosfork answer this question. If you're the first person to post a comment with the right answer, you will win. You know, it's not such a bad idea to go on later with the Facebook Live. I noticed we had more people with us. Okay, uh, what do you want to ask about? Here's the... Right there. Okay. What's, if you, if you go to susosfork.com and in that first row of pictures and recipes, you'll see a... Wait, we already did that. We already asked that question. Okay, in the second row of pictures and recipes, <laughs> you'll see... Go to the second row of pictures and recipes. In the second row. The second row of pictures and well, recipes. Well, you have to go to the recipes area. Of susosfork.com. Yeah. yeah, hit go to the recipes. recipes area. And in the second row... You'll see... You'll see a kind of soup. What kind of soup, soup? is... Oh, yeah. yeah, okay. What kind of soup is in the second row yeah. of pictures in the recipe page of susosfork.com? And then while you're at it... First person to post that correct answer gets the book. While you're at it. Look at how dark it is. We look so crazy lit from, like, underneath. Okay. Like we don't need that light. It's scary. That light it is scary. scary. It makes us look scary. Yeah. Um, yeah, what's the recipe? So what we really want you to do is go to susosfork.com and subscribe because we have a lot of surprises coming your way. No, that's a guess, Patrick. Patrick, you didn't even go there. Susosfork.com, S-U-S-O-S, not ramen. You got to no. go to the site. You guys are just guessing. But the link is right in this post. So do, like people, where we... do people then have to leave this site to do that? Huh? Gold? Yes. Oh, oh wait. Oh, people are talking to uh, other people who are commenting here. I, oh. thought, I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> I miss you, Mary. Where are you? What's the answer? What's the answer? What kind of soup are we talking about? Go to susosfork.com. You can hit the link. And it it's, will, uh, we'll send you the book. It's right there. And then um, write it in the comments. And, and the next prize we give away will be, I'll give you the shirt off my back next. How's oh, yeah. That? How is that? This lighting is the worst. Okay, wait. We should be lit from from above. Wouldn't that be better? No, we just need the sun. 
No, not lemon soup. I do why like, did you I do like, the, I do like, I do fork? like Greek soup. I've gone lemon soup. Gary, you know what? Now the favorites. mosquitoes are here. Hi, Demetrius. Not split pea. No. Go to the recipe. You can't get this by guessing. Yeah, you can't get it by. I just saw a flash of what? No, not. Yes. Patrick gets it. Cream of Malanga. Hey, Patrick. By the way. Send Patrick us an email uh, and remind me that you won the, uh, the famous book. Just say the famous book and put your address in there, your contact info, so we can mail it out to you. And you just send that to our email. Bob and Marianne at WLSAM.com. And now, the President of the United States. All right. See you tomorrow. Bye. Do I hit finish now? Yes. Oh, okay. Hit finish. We're finished. I get it. <laughs>